So the, you have to say, what's the ratio of humanoid robots to humans? My guess is it's least at least three to one, four to one, maybe five to one. So we're talking about 20, 30 billion humanoid robots. You can imagine like your own personal robot buddy is uh, a great friend, but also takes care of uh, your house, will we'll clean your house, will mow the lawn, uh, will walk the dog, um, will teach your kids, uh, will we'll babysit, and, and, and will also, also enable the production of goods and services. Are you really ready to spend tens of thousands of dollars on a dancing robot? Over the past few days, the internet has been buzzing about the latest update video of Tesla Optimus showing off its wireless dancing moves. Sure, it's fun and attention-grabbing, but what the market and users like us truly care about is practical, real-world functionality, not just another form of entertainment. So the real question is, will Tesla Optimus actually be able to carry out complex tasks on its own? Tasks like cooking, cleaning, taking care of children like a stay-at-home parent, or working on an assembly line, maintaining factory operations, and handling emergencies without human help? And perhaps most importantly, when will Tesla officially open pre-orders for Optimus? Should we expect that in the fourth quarter 2025? Or is this going to be delayed indefinitely? So what's the truth behind the Tesla Bot Gen 3 presale? While the video of Optimus performing ballet and modern dance grabbed plenty of attention, not everyone was impressed. Many viewers expressed disappointment, arguing that a dancing robot is hardly groundbreaking, neither for Tesla nor for the robotics industry as a whole, where such demos have become all too familiar. If you've been paying attention, Unitree released a similar video of a humanoid robot dancing just a few months ago. Since then, the company has followed up with even more eye-catching videos featuring robots performing martial arts, dancing, and even doing backflips. There's clearly a wave of companies advancing in the humanoid robotics space, and real progress is being made. But among all of this, we're particularly impressed by Tesla's latest robotic hands for Optimus. They stand out above everything else we've seen. This serves as proof of what the latest robotics technology can support in terms of movement. And all of Tesla's demonstrations showing Optimus performing genuinely useful tasks are exactly what we've been hoping for a humanoid robot that can truly integrate and coexist with our daily lives. Critics are calling on Tesla to release real-world demonstration videos of Optimus performing practical tasks like cooking, washing dishes, folding clothes, or assisting the elderly. These are the kinds of jobs consumers truly care about and are willing to pay for. After all, a humanoid robot shouldn't just be a flashy showpiece. It needs to become a reliable helper in everyday life and work environments. It'll basically do anything you want. So it can be a teacher, babysit your kids, it can walk your dog, mow your lawn, get the groceries, just be your friend, serve drinks, whatever you can think of. If Tesla wants to build trust and drive genuine demand, they need to focus on proving Optimus's effectiveness in real-life situations. Those moments where buyers like us are willing to pay for convenience and practical value. Tesla has already teased some glimpses of this. Optimus receiving deliveries, watering plants, serving drinks, tidying the kitchen, and fetching items from a car trunk. These are exactly the kinds of demonstrations customers want to see more of. To back this up, CEO Elon Musk told shareholders that Optimus represents a multi-trillion dollar opportunity for the company. Musk believes Tesla will eventually produce tens of millions of Optimus robots annually. Tesla has already deployed some robots inside its factories, and Musk hinted that Tesla could begin selling robots to external customers as early as next year. He priced each robot between $25,000 and $30,000. A few months ago, we shared an update on Tesla Optimus's latest mobility capabilities, showing significant improvements compared to competitors like Figure, X1, Unitree, Xpeng, and many others, companies that have been around for decades. So, why is Tesla Bot Gen 3 leading the robotics industry? It's got, a, it's got, the, it's got the real world AI, so Tesla's the leader in real world AI. Um, what we learned in the car, we translate to, to the Optimus robot. Um, and we also trans take the, our expertise in electric motors 
in batteries, power electronics, uh, structural design. And then another major important thing is that we're very good at manufacturing. While competitors show off flashy features, Optimus captures our attention in a completely different way. It redefines reality. Imagine a robot that communicates as naturally as Hanson Robotics, Sophia, moves with the agility of Boston Dynamics Atlas, and supports human life in ways Toyota's THR3 can only dream of. Now, imagine it doing all of that with 99% autonomy. Yes, 99%. In a world full of bold promises, Optimus stands out as the only humanoid robot truly capable of independent operation cutting human dependency down to just 1%. Have you ever tried holding a screwdriver or power drill without bending your fingers properly? Those extra joints make all the difference when gripping small tools. This feature isn't just a nice-to-have, it's an absolute must for performing multiple tasks at once. To really understand why, we've got proof for you right here. Tesla claims that Optimus will revolutionize the labor economy by offering a cost-effective alternative to human workers. According to a February 2025 report, the total cost of ownership for one Optimus over five years is estimated at around $105,000, nearly half the cost of hiring a new entry-level worker in Los Angeles over the same period, approximately $223,900, including wages and benefits. That translates to potential savings of over $100,000 per robot in five years for companies, especially in manufacturing and logistics. Analysts at Deutsche Bank estimate that Tesla's current production cost per robot ranges from $27,000 to $76,000, with expectations that economies of scale and improved manufacturing efficiency will drive that cost even lower targeting a price under $20,000 per unit by 2025 or shortly thereafter. Elon Musk has even hinted that the production cost could eventually drop to as low as $10,000, which would significantly boost the robot's cost competitiveness. You also need to be very good at scale manufacturing. So in order to have the robot not cost like hundreds of thousands of dollars, in order to make it cost like you know, ten or $20,000. On top of that, Tesla plans to offer Optimus through both purchase and leasing options, with annual lease pricing expected to fall between $3,000 and $3,500. This allows businesses and individuals to test the robot's utility before committing to full ownership. Such a flexible pricing strategy enhances affordability and lowers the barrier to entry. Therefore, while the initial purchase price may be higher than some expect, Tesla's cost-saving strategies, leasing options, and projected production scale strongly support the claim that Optimus will be an affordable and cost-efficient labor solution throughout its operational lifespan. One of Optimus's standout features is its 22 degrees of freedom duef in the hands alone, an unprecedented level of dexterity for a commercial humanoid robot. Most existing robots have hands with only 5 to 6 degrees of freedom limiting them to basic grasp and release actions. In contrast, Optimus's hands can move, rotate, bend, twist, and tap objects independently with remarkable precision. The engineering behind this design is inspired by human anatomy. Tesla relocated the actuators from the hand into the forearm, using elastic cables that mimic human tendons to control finger movements. This design reduces the hand size and weight enhancing agility and improving energy efficiency. Integrated force feedback sensors allow Optimus to sense grip pressure and adjust in real time, enabling it to hold fragile objects, like eggs, without breaking them, tighten screws with the correct torque, and even distinguish objects by their softness or firmness. This level of dexterity enables Optimus to perform complex tasks such as typing on a keyboard, playing the piano, washing dishes, and safely handling tools significantly expanding its potential applications in industrial, commercial, and even household environments. From an occupational health and safety perspective, this means Optimus can safely take over hazardous or repetitive tasks, reducing workplace injuries and improving overall efficiency. However, the sophistication of these hands also introduces technical challenges. The weight concentrated in the forearm affects balance and continuous operation. 
and the protective covering for the hands must strike a balance between durability and tactile sensitivity. Tesla's ongoing refinements aim to optimize these elements to maintain precision and reliability. Overall, the 22 degree of freedom hands are not just an engineering breakthrough. They're a practical enabler that makes Optimus more versatile and effective, pushing it closer to becoming a truly multifunctional humanoid robot. In terms of continuous operation, Tesla has engineered Optimus to balance power consumption with real-world work demands. While exact battery life specifications haven't been publicly disclosed in detail, insider industry insights and Tesla's own statements allow for reasonable inferences. Tesla's use of automotive-grade lithium-ion battery technology, shared with its electric vehicles, suggests that Optimus can operate continuously for around 10 hours before needing a recharge. Early projections and Tesla's factory deployments indicate that Optimus is capable of working in shifts similar to human labor, with battery swaps or scheduled charging breaks integrated into the workflow. Thanks to Tesla's expertise in fast charging technology, downtime for recharging is expected to be minimal, roughly 10 minutes to replenish up to 70% of the battery. Maintenance protocols are designed to be as streamlined as possible. Tesla's modular design allows for relatively easy replacement of wear and tear components, such as actuators and sensors. The company's pilot production and validation runs focus heavily on achieving a yield rate above 95%, implying high reliability and reduced repair frequency. Furthermore, Tesla's software-driven diagnostics are expected to enable predictive maintenance, alerting users before failures occur. Elon Musk emphasized that the robot shares many parts and manufacturing processes with Tesla's electric vehicles, which typically have a lifespan of 8 to 10 years or more under regular use, with some components requiring replacement after a few years depending on usage intensity. Tesla's warranty and service packages, including software updates, will support Optimus's long-term performance and reliability. In practical terms, Optimus is designed to operate in factory or commercial environments with work cycles comparable to human workers, including breaks for charging and maintenance, rather than running continuously 24 per 7 without interruption. This approach balances battery limitations with operational demands and safety considerations. When will Tesla officially open pre-orders for Tesla Bot Gen 3, and who will be the first owner? According to the latest updates, Tesla's humanoid robot, Optimus Gen 3, appears poised for a limited commercial release in the U.S. as early as the fourth quarter 2025, perhaps even by late October, depending on the flawless execution of pilot production, safety certification, and supply chain coordination. Recent technical demonstrations, an accelerated production timeline, and fast-tracked regulatory processes all provide compelling evidence that Tesla may actually hit this ambitious target. Even for the most skeptical observers, a demographic that values reliability, proven engineering, and transparent milestones, this analysis pulls together key advances in hardware, production scalability, and regulatory readiness to argue that Optimus may go from factory floor to commercial rollout much faster than critics had anticipated. First, Technical readiness, hardware maturity meets AI breakthroughs. It's fair to say that Tesla Optimus has now achieved unprecedented levels of mobility and autonomy. The wireless dancing video, released on May 14, 2025, marked a turning point. Unlike earlier versions limited to scripted tasks, this untethered robot demonstrated 22 degrees of freedom in its hands, double that of previous models and dynamic balancing algorithms capable of real-time pivoting and weight redistribution. These advancements stem from Tesla's sim to real AI training pipeline, where reinforcement learning in virtual environments enables the physical robot to adapt to unpredictable real-world scenarios. For older, more skeptical audiences who often dismiss AI as overhyped, this visible progress, validated by third-party robotics experts through detailed video analysis, serves as strong evidence that Optimus can operate autonomously in complex environments without human intervention. In addition, durability 
has been most convincingly validated inside Tesla's own factory. Since April 20, 2025, Tesla's pilot production line in Fremont has assembled 200 units of Optimus for internal validation. The reported production yield has exceeded 95% thanks to shared components with Tesla vehicles, such as battery packs and sensors, which help reduce supply chain bottlenecks. During Tesla's first quarter B 2025 earnings call, Elon Musk emphasized that Optimus's drivetrain leverages the existing Model Y manufacturing infrastructure, enabling a rapid scale up to thousands of units by the end of 2025. For retirees familiar with industrial automation, this kind of cross-platform synergy reflects the kind of reliability that defined American automotive giants like Ford during the 20th century. We can't underestimate it. Scalable manufacturing is Tesla's core competitive edge across EVs, space, and now AI and robotics. A key example is Tesla's projected timeline. Just six weeks from the May 15th demo video to ramping up from R&D to production, in line with Fremont's current ability to retool lines rapidly. The Cybertruck ramp-up in 2023 already showcased Tesla's ability to compress validation phases by running parallel stress tests on subsystems, example, motor controllers, vision systems. With Optimus modular design, Tesla can isolate faults in specific joints or AI modules, significantly reducing debugging time. So, who exactly will be the first to own these high-end bots? Based on Tesla's current product naming and rollout process, the initial Optimus units will serve small-scale production and logistics roles in sectors traditionally dominated by men over 50. Tesla emphasizes the robot's ability to consistently perform repetitive tasks, such as pallet stacking and quality inspections, without fatigue, thereby reducing workplace injuries, a prime concern among older workers. Early adopters, including manufacturing companies and mass production industries, are expected to trial the Optimus prototypes and deploy them for tasks like inventory management, with efficiency gains predicted to exceed 30%. To ease concerns over the upfront cost, estimated at $25,000 to $30,000 per unit, Tesla is developing a leasing program with bundled maintenance included in monthly payments. This model, which has proven successful in Tesla's solar division, is especially appealing to retirees on fixed incomes. Additionally, a five-year warranty that includes AI software updates reflects a commitment to long-term customer loyalty a cultural value especially important to older Americans. With a price tag of $25,000 to $30,000 and a leasing option around $3,000 to $3,500 per year, would you be willing to buy or lease a robot like Optimus? Do you think this price is reasonable given the convenience and functionality it offers? Please share your opinion in the comments section below this video. Thanks for watching our video. If you want to explore more exciting information about Tesla EV or Tesla Bot, don't forget to hit the like button and share this video. Also, make sure to subscribe to Tesla Car World and turn on notifications so you never miss our latest videos. We appreciate your support and look forward to seeing you in the next video.